despite the nasty weather out there. Yeah. Today, <laughs> Feltz Field is having an open house. And there will be a lot of goings on at the historic airstrip today. Right now, Katie Steiner is live inside one of the aircraft, and she joins us on Mobile 6, our new portable live camera. Katie? We are here at Feltz Field for Neighbor Days, and I am sitting in the best seat of the house. And I have Dan here, and he is the pilot of the B-17 that we're in right now. Can you kind of explain the historical significance behind, behind this cockpit that we're in? This is probably the most historically significant airplane in history, the B-17. Uh, this airplane was made in 1945. They built 12,731 B-17s, and this is one of 13 remaining. What, what do you think is one of the coolest parts of this cockpit, the things that we're looking at right now? Is there something you can point out? Well, it's a big tail dragger airplane. Uh, it's uh, built tremendously strong. Uh, that's why it brought a lot of people back. And remember, these were young men. They were 19 to 23 years old and the bravest young men I've ever seen. Yeah. And so you guys fly this around nine months out of the year going to different places. Right. We go around, uh, the airplane belongs to the Experimental Aircraft Association in Oshkosh, Wisconsin. And we go around to EA chapters around the country and they sponsor us for a few days. And We've been here at Spokane several times and this is always one of our best stops. And do people really like coming and seeing this bomber? Oh yeah, it's, it's a historically significant airplane as we talked about, but you know, just about every family has someone that was associated with B-17s in World War II. And how do people get down here to come and see this wonderful airplane? Well, come down to Feltz Field. You can take a ground tour, and uh, you can fly on it also. And, uh, boy, that's a treat. Absolutely. Well, thank you so much for bringing this airplane out and coming out and spending time with us. Now, I am in the co-pilot seat. Is that right. correct? You are the commanding pilot. Well, I'm in pilot. The, they call it the aircraft commander seat, but I'm in that seat right now. We switch every day. Rick and I, Rick Fernald is from Seattle. Well, I like sitting here in the seat, but um, Blake, I think we are going to take this airplane out for a little spin here. I have my my um, headphones on, so we're ready cool. to go. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Blake. Back to you. And she now can't hear anything else. Uh, very cool, though. That was uh, very neat to look inside that B-17 bomber. And if I'm not mistaken, I could hear a little bit of the rain kind of on the way.